Since the revival of the East African community in 1999, the five member states in the trade bloc have been eyeing higher frontiers. The need for integration climaxed into the creation of a lawmaking arm ushering in the East African Legislative Assembly, IALA. To politicians, legislation at regional level is seen as a direct avenue for stronger laws to aid the community, although there are traces of failed law implementation. We've got a, a consensus building way of making decisions. This makes it strong in a sense that once something is decided, that everyone is in agreement, we move along. But the problem with the full consensus is that a lot of decisions are actually delayed. Ideally, we, we can say that not all laws are extremely implemented in accordance with the date of assent to such laws. Member state uh, uh, presidents, when they are talking, you all they see that they are talking that in, in, the, in the positive direction. The challenge we have are the technocrats who are supposed to implement some of these. Presidents don't implement, but they oversee. They oversee what they have resolved, what they have directed for people to implement. After we have done what we need to do at the assembly. We as members of parliament from IALA have a responsibility of going to first sensitize the stakeholders involved. We need to sensitize the stakeholders. We need to also sensitize parliament. Then we need to make sure that these two are running in tandem in terms of understanding what it is and in terms of moving the agenda. Because members of national parliament play a very key role in domesticating what has been passed at the regional level. And that is just the start of many problems that need to be surmounted. Some delegates even see in some member states a key stumbling block. Whereas in some high work permit charges have been slashed, in others there are still high fees charged on East African citizens, making it hard to fulfill the dream of free movement of people, goods and services. There is some other countries which has already removed it completely the issue of working, cap, working permit. Like uh, I think if not mistaken, Rwanda has done that one. Kenya has done that one as well. In the other countries, we try to talk to them so that we can see that you can be in one boat. Work permits in, in some way is like a, a tariff. It's a tariff because what is the intention of a work permit? It may be collection of revenue or barring people from movement. Because if I don't give you a work permit, you will not come to my area. It's good uh, you have learned from this meeting that uh, uh, other than Tanzania, the rest of the member states have agreed for the ID to be used by their nationals to move across. So we are still waiting to see whether Tanzania will also cooperate in that direction. Still on the other hand, some delegates at the 7th Nanyuchi Conference doubt the will of partner states to cede their sovereign powers. Because they have just given a little power to the community, a little power to the assembly. But they need to cede some of it if the integration must be implemented. And the only way you do that is to allow processes to unfold and take you know, take take root and move on. But if you keep on holding on to it, holding on to it, then you, you deter uh, the process of development. Those in favor of deepening political integration count on IALA's past successes, among them enactment of crucial bills such as the Vehicle Load Control Bill, among others. Those are good uh, statutes that are going to ensure that our people in the cause of trade, in the cause of their business, they are going to, to achieve and they are going to make a better place for themselves. We know now that uh, out of this, we also now have uh, what we call the Speaker's Bureau. Uh, under circumstances, the five speakers of the East African, uh, East African community sit together and they are able now to see, because within the treaty, for instance, all our bills, all our legislations, all our resolutions and motions are supposed to be tabled in the parliaments and then they are supposed to be debated. So since earlier on it was a little bit difficult even to find space, the Speaker's Bureau is addressing this. Moses Walgembe, UBC News, Entebbe. You are right.